what's up guys and as I promised here's the new project it's a 76 Harley ish it's an AMF uh, SS 250 um, it's a pretty cool looking bike it has a two-stroke 250 cc motor and uh, I'm really pumped about it uh, but there's a bunch of stuff that I need to do with it um, as you can see it's definitely far from perfect um, if you have parts laying around let me know be happy to take them off your hands um, but that's that's my big my big thing right now uh, so so far all I've done was drain the transmission fluid and make sure that the the oil pump was working the oil pump is working so it injects the two cycle oil so it, I don't have to do any pre-mixing or anything with the gas it does it all itself on the inside and you know I pulled the transmission fluid out and it looks like that and it's not supposed to look like that so I'm gonna go ahead and dump it uh, again I've topped it off dumped it and got a fresh gasket here so I can pull it out make sure everything's good under there with the uh, with the clutch and transmission and once I get that all done I will post a video of it running but that's where we're going today so new project tons of stuff will be coming out with this thing um, and for now I'll just bring you along to change this gasket and drain the fluid again Still milky. All right, now I'm just gonna take off the trans cover. It's three flathead screws holding this on. Got my sidekick over here walking around nervously. I'm using this trim tool, just kind of pull it out. So it's still a little milky, but it's clearer than it was. So taking that as a good sign that I'm at least going in the right direction. Doesn't smell like gas or anything, so. All right, with this cover off now, I'm just gonna clean the cover, scrape off this old paper gasket, scrape the gasket off of the trans cover there, and then I'll put the new gasket on and fill it up with some more fresh gear oil, and then I'll probably run it around a little bit and drain it again. But this is gonna be, well this is, step one of probably a very long series of steps in getting this bike somewhat decent so let me go ahead and start doing this now
All right, so I got most of the gasket off and I'll probably hit it, well not probably, I'm going to hit it with some brake parts cleaner outside to get a lot of this dirt and things that are in here out. Um, and I'm going to do the same thing too. Cover here, just scrape inside carefully to try not to let anything fall into the transmission. And once I get this all done, I'll clean it up also, put the new one on, new gasket. Sweet. Here's the cover all cleaned off with brake parts cleaner and scrubbed. The mating surfaces are nice and clean. I mean, it looks all stained, but it's very smooth now. Nice and clean, so you can plug up the trans, put the cover back on, and fill it up, and run it for a bit. All right, so here we are all buttoned up. I already filled it with fluid. I'm using just cheap gear oil since I'm gonna be flushing through it. Uh, the service manual calls for 75 weight. So I'm running 80 right now, um, and that should be okay. So let me take it outside really quick and start it up. There we go, just a little test strip to get the fluids moving. Let it sit for a little bit and get back to it. Um, but yeah, for a cheap project, it's not bad. Needs a lot of work. So like I said, if you have parts, let me know. I need just about everything. So yeah, thanks for watching, thanks for the support. And I'll be doing a lot more on this bike in the very near future. Very near future. Thanks.